The state's largest high school only has one road in and out. That's for nearly 3,000 students and faculty, and many say it's a safety hazard. That road is located at Dennis Chavez on Highway 118 in southwest Albuquerque. Action 7 News reporter Regina Reese explains the first step in fixing the problem is underway. Very serious traffic issues at this school. There have been traffic issues for a couple of years now. A major traffic backup. Instead of a New York minute, let's call it an Atrisco Heritage High School minute. I think it's a pretty big deal because we live less than a minute away and it, I have to leave at 7 just to get him here in time for school to start at 7.30. And after school from Sky 7, you can see the long line of traffic slowly moving along towards the only exit. 2,500 students come to this South Valley school. As the school grows, the problem only gets bigger. But now... We want to remove any distraction from the mission of the school, like just trying to get to the school in the morning. Community and school leaders gathered to come up with traffic solutions. This is a safety issue, and that's the point I like to stress. Um, it's not an access issue. It's not a convenience issue. It really is a safety issue. There are about a thousand cars that park in this parking lot every single day, and the problem's only gonna get worse. This K through 8 school is gonna be opening soon, but one solution mentioned today: there's a dirt road at the back of the school that has never been paved. I know that we can we can solve this issue. It is some it is some different government agencies, but you know that doesn't mean that it. You can't solve it. I think everybody can work together to do this. Short term solutions from the meeting today are putting up traffic safety signs and using the dirt road. A long term solution is to pave that road and have additional drop off areas. There will be another traffic meeting soon. This time it will be in the evening, so parents who work during the day can attend. Albuquerque police say they have busted two women.